the sound, the sound of silence is wonderful. Guys, let's get into it before this bottle starts turning back to a regular solid close today, but that's okay. I was up close last time. What's it up? We're gonna try to eat this. What are you doing? It's doing you. It's doing you too. Let's put it in the bowl. Let's just eat them. Let's just pour this inside this bowl. Delicious garlic. They gave me a lot of stuff. Leave it this way. Leave it that way. Let's say Grace. Let's get into it. I'll wait for the gloves. Father, thank you for this food I'm about to receive to nourish the body. For Christ's sake, amen. That's my family, that's the homeless sick shut in. That everybody's thankful for meals today. Amen. People used to say, I can't hear you, I can't hear you. But now I guess it's loud enough. Let's get into this right here. Look at that. Look at that. Yumminess. Mm hmm. They have one spoon. I have to get everything out. Mm -hmm. Look how pretty that egg is. I bought the garlic. That garlic is good. Let's put a, a muscle on top of that egg. Tastes good though. Mm -hmm. Simply amazing. Mm -mm. I don't want it to be on the floor. Mm. It looked like they just simply melted butter. I don't know what kind of butter. I think it's the garlic giving it the best flavor. I still forgot a knife this time. I do have a spoon. Let me see if I can cut the back of it. I thought of everything, but I cut the back of these shrimps. Mm. I know people just not ready to send their kids to school. Cause it's so uncertain. Mm -hmm. I didn't even put the gloves on. Well, guess I don't need them. I already started. I mean, Mr. Smith, he don't eat no seafood. I don't think he eat meat at all. 
this pretty on size, Mr. Smith. I'm making too much noise. Look at that meat. Oh my goodness. Mm. Better the second time around. I mean, I don't like to make judgments or talk about the vaccine too much, but other than sharing with people that probably haven't been vaccinated, I don't like to. I don't like to share too much with people that's been vaccinated because it looks as if I'm trying to scare you. Mm -mm. I feel if I'm trying to scare you or something. I don't like when people try to tell people who need to get vaccinated and shouldn't cause that's a that's your choice it'll always be your choice shouldn't be no government choice shouldn't be people's choice only your choice for you and your family to get through it. I'm just saying this crazy about it, other than my opinion, but I think the government is just doing way too much. They're doing way too much. They want everybody to be in the uproar about this virus or something. Because one minute you're safe, the next minute you ain't. I don't know if it's working because to me, I think if it's working, people that's fully vaccinated shouldn't need to wear a mask. They should be good against COVID vac vaccines for the virus. It should affect the virus so you don't have to wear anything. You should be good. And I don't believe that people who are not vaccinated is causing a new variant when most people that's not vaccinated know they still need to wear their masks because they're not vaccinated. So this stuff ain't making no sense. Mm. Egg is good. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Mm. Last summer, <laughs> they had crabs on sale for like got three of these um, pieces. It was on sale. It was like eight coins for two dollars. I bought like 16 or 20 coins. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm, my boy 
where somebody's calling. I've seen this guy in Detroit, he had a soul food truck, he had everything on there, fried green tomatoes, pork tops. Yeah, I do. I to make it some good food. With COVID and the restaurants being closed, you can go up to a truck and get your soul food meal. I think he's, I don't forgot what she said, corn of Cotillus, Cotillus and Lavin or something like that. I don't really know Detroit, but go look at Shay video on um, soul food on wheels. They say that soul food is good. I think it was in 20, I had got a bag like this when I went out with Fifi up in the city. And that bag was like 47 or $50 too. And they had some rice in that restaurant. I don't remember the name of the place. If, if you make it this far in the video, um, put up a crab. For all this good crabs and seafood that I'm not getting. That Miss Fifi is even <laughs> put a crab up in the comment for a seafood boy. Oh, put a shrimp with some eyes or something. Mm. But I guess everything been open up in the city again. Mm -mm. That shrimp is soft. I don't know why these ones are small or if they don't got that. That noodle. They don't got that thing in the back. Yeah, that's a lot of shrimp still. Yeah. They wore some of them too long. They looking soft. And I don't trust it. I don't trust the ones that feel mushy. Because shrimp ain't supposed to be soft. Supposed to be hot. I like that one.
got some pleasure out of watching the videos that they be doing camping by the snow and by the water. Tell me if you watch those kind of videos. It's all fun to me. I've been watching that lately. I'll be watching people eat too. potato. Mmm. That thing's so good. Tell me how you pay your bill. I was just sitting here thinking. Do everybody pay their bill when they come? Pay the whole bill? Oh. You pay that $29. That they say you gotta pay every month. How do you pay your bill? I do you have a couple of delinquent ones. Delinquent bills. I could tell you that those delinquent bills is a no-no. That's how they're going to make their money off of you. Because they're going to get you in credit. Delinquent, keep charging you fees. And then when they sign off that card, there's going to be a whole lot, a whole lot of fees added. Every minute that you're going to pay that bill, which will eventually affect your credit. And if you want, I'm telling you from experience, if you want your credit to be affected by the way you pay your bill, you have to occasionally pay that whole bill. I know some of us can't always do that. Because everybody's pocket ain't the same. I don't know what's going on with these things looking mushy they got to go mm -mm. what was that saying yeah Nobody can tell them right what's in their wallet, what they got when you got kids. You got back to school right now. Sometimes you gotta get a second job. 
Things is hard. Especially when you have children. You just got yourself. You don't got to worry as hard as you can find what you got in the house to eat. You don't have to buy yourself nothing new, but kids can't be wearing the same stuff. Kids at school pay picks and bully them. I don't believe kids that don't don't bring good grades and get them. Michael Jordan sneakers either. That's just my own personal opinion. But my kids got a certain age, like 16 or 18, and they were still at home. I said, you want Michael Jordan sneakers? I'll give you $100 if you're keeping up your grade. But um, you're going to have to get you a little job to put the rest. I'm just not willing to spend more than hundred dollars. I mean, eventually, my son got older. They was buying their own sneakers, and it was like, "What you want for Christmas?" Oh, I want a pair of sneakers. I'm like, "Don't go past two twenty-five. <laughs> Those sneakers are expensive. I ain't paying no five hundred dollars for no sneakers." I'm not paying no twelve hundred dollars for no game system. Well, I did. I bought one of them game system, Nintendo, but I don't think it was quite. It was about five hundred. It wasn't twelve hundred, and that was too much. That was too much. Not to be getting some super duper grades. For one of them. Look okay, at PlayStation 4, 5, 6, I don't know. Them things are expensive. They like 1200 How much they cost? I don't even want to know. I just don't want nobody to ask me to buy one. Because the answer is no. This is when you're so full. You're so good you can't stop. Ooh. Take these heads off of this thing. I know my conversation be like so many different topics, but I be having a lot on my mind, and I just come here and talk with you guys. Mm. Guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Mm. Almost good job.
I find something to call it this sweet corn later. Look how sweet that corn is. I don't even think I gave you all anything. I'm sorry. Next thing for war. We'll be good. Oh, this is sweet too. Cut the butt back of that corn. Because it's so sweet. Anyway, guys, I'm out of here. Well, thumbs up the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Well, like, comment, and share. And if you feel like it and you want to come back, subscribe and press the bell and come back. I don't do a lot of these seafood boils, but when I do it, it's well worth it. It's delicious. A little costly. I need to do, um, um, cucumber with rice and sausage. But, yeah, I cut back on the sausage because of the processed meat. And, and it's bagged up in a whole lot of sodium. You know, I gotta try and stay away from it just for a while. So, I've been mixing that stuff. Some sausage, some salty thing. I'll be tasting that salt immediately. I'm going so I can get up and get that water. 